how funny that I've actually beaten a new beginning. I I really like the Legend of Spyro games, and I really like uh like I I really like a new beginning. It's just that it's almost as if you've been upset about getting eggs this whole game. <laughs> I just don't care about them in this game. Oh, what am I gonna do? Play as Ember? What am I gonna do? Look at concept art that's probably already online. Oh good, I didn't even do the... God damn it. Unpopular opinion. Legend... That seems to be the consensus in this chat. Legend of Spyro game should get a remake. A reignited trilogy of the Legend of Spyro games could actually be really fucking dope. I just think that, like, I think they spent a lot of money on a lot of, like, big names that aren't professional voice actors. Like, the voice acting in that game for me falls a little flat. I don't know. I said that, like, 30 minutes ago. Just ask the captain, please. Captain was my, captain was my father. Call me Silver. This was the dark gem I never knew about how to get to as a kid, by the way. <sighs> okay. Now that all of that bullshit is over. Now that all of that actual horseshit is over. Oh god, okay. Oh yeah, and I don't have water breath yet to fucking get that light gem. That's cool. Oh, is this also taking me to a fucking egg? God, the, the music is so good. I should be grocery shopping, but I think I broke a few ribs? Broke a rib a few days ago. Um, if you think you might have broken a rib, get that looked at? The music in this game is probably why I loved it. Vibes, vibes. It's all vibes. Oh yeah, there she is. There she is. Yeah, I probably should, shouldn't I? Healthcare's free. <laughs> but hospitals. We'll come back to her. Now that I... Oh god. They put her in, like, a fucking milkmaid outfit. What is that? What is that apron dress combo? My god. Go watch your babies die. Why is she just- why is she dressed like a Bavarian woman? Anyways, off topic here, play Rocket Power Beach Bandits. Oh my god, I- Oh my god, I haven't thought about Rocket Power in, like, decades. Oh my god, Rocket Power. How did she clothe herself with flippers? I want to try for a dragon egg? No, I want to try for a crystal. I- or a light gem. I don't care about dragon eggs. I have, I have a list. People have asked, I have a list of um, games people have asked for. If you'd like, I can put Rocket Power Beach Bandits on my list. Oh my god. Turtle Turmoil. Is this also just a, okay, yeah. Aw, oh, fuck, aw, oh, fuck. Everything is wrong, everything is wrong. No, the turtles! I'm sorry, I really gotta focus right here. Ah, uh, fuck. Ah, uh, fuck. Shit. No. No! There's so many birds. Oh, 
Oh, there goes one of them. Not saving that kid. No. No! Wait, why is this really hard? Wait. Wait, oh god. Why was that so hard all of a sudden? Please, okay, yeah, hang on, let me, uh, just got, I just gotta write down, um, rocket power beach bandits. Okay. This looks ridiculous. There goes, watch sea turtles die in the beach, it was like, this would make a great mini game. Fucking Christ, I forgot the crabs had people voices. Honestly, on the topic of beating this game, I don't remember if I did before we returned it to the blockbuster. 20 kids is enough, the rest can- If the rest die, they die. If he dies, he dies. At least you only needed to save 20. Oh my god. And now I get to do it all again for a light jam! Yay! Yay! <laughs> Hey lady, I saved 20 of your kids. Why did you take this egg? It was on the beach, but I don't think it's one of mine. There is another class heading off for a swim. Help them into the water and I will give you another reward. Okay. You've already wanted would you like to try for a light gem? Oh da -da -da! another egg. God, I hate it. 27, okay. No, no, it's already happening. I turn away for a second. Oh god, are they faster now? Are these birds faster now? God, those those crabs really do have fucking messed up voices. Oh, did I lose one? Shit. How? What is happening? I don't think I don't think this is happening. I don't think this is happening. I think I'm I think I might lose. There's so many of them. Yeah, Crabbo got him. Holy shit. Do you want to try again? Nah. I got some light gems. I'm doing pretty good on light gems as far as I know. As far as I know. I'm doing, I'm doing good on light gems. You killed the turtles. No, I think the birds killed the turtles. I think I'm cool and perfect. I think I, I think I am pretty neat and that uh, the birds and the crabs killed the turtles. Oh, I didn't even have sparks. Okay. Man, you know how they ask if you want to do it again for fun after you beat them twice? Yeah, and I hate it. I'm just thinking about the implications of that there. <laughs> Oh, it looks like it looks like more of my children need help, Spyro, but I don't have anything else to give you. Well, that sucks, lady. There we go. That's how I beat this man to death. Look, lady, if you don't have any way to pay me for my services, get Ben. Spyro, please. They're eating my babies. That's nature, lady. Nature's a bitch. Tonight, Spyro feast on God. Crab sounds so good. <laughs> to quote Spyro, eh? 
chicks. I mean, she could pay for your services and... No. None, none of that here. None of that here. That, that woman is an upstanding citizen. None of that here. No. Did you really just bring up sc scalies in my wholesome Christian chat? I'm not afraid, by the way. I'm just making a joke. I'm pretty sure it says somewhere in the Bible, uh, scalies will be smited. Scalies will be smote. I'm pretty sure that's what the Bible says. I've never read it. But... Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> Thou shan't fuck it, fuck us to the turtles. I bequeath hell upon ye, turtle fucker. Or the other way around, it's not even a threat, it's just, please don't fuck the turtles. There's no law against it, but just please don't. Why is this, why can I not? Okay. I'm gonna call someone a turtle fucker and see how they react. I mean, if somebody's got them turtle fucker vibes, you can't help it. It's the big one! It's the big racist! God, what is a turtle fucker vibe? I think you'll know it when you see it. Like, I don't think there's... I don't think there's explicitly, like, a checklist. I just DM'd my roommate. Hey, hey, yo, turtle fucker. I got a, huh? What'd you just call me? Hmm, back here. Anyway. I need... Oh, God. Less than 200 more gems. I can get that around here somewhere. Nope, that's- I gotta charge them first. Why? Why is this so slippery? Why do I just go around them? Why are they round? There, 10,000. I'm gonna go buy the super head bash. Now watch it be temporary. You can also electric- Ooh! I can electric the big ones. Good to know. Ah, there you are, my favorite wallet. Why not buy more? Awesome. Electric doesn't give a shit about armor, just takes longer to kill him. Yeah, that's what I that's what I remember. Oh, I hate the noises they make. Um, hmm. You should be dead by now. Is it not working? I swear you could. I believe you for, like, the armored norks. Like, I do remember lightning working on more enemies oh it's just a little dude dead I remember zapping the crabs I too remember zapping the crabs I don't know what's going on I think this game just might be broken
Awesome. Um, fire. We'll go back to fire since... God. Oh, God. I hate... I hate trying to move around on tiny platforms. There is no turning in place. Spyro just wants to move. We can do it. We can make it. I can, I can make it. No, you know, if you're looking for turtle, turtle fucker vibes, if you want to know what to find... Oh, good! Awesome. Oh, um... Hold on. I remember PS2 games looking better than they do, and it always fucks me up. If you're looking for a turtle fucker vibes, the otter. Somewhere around here, there's an otter. That guy is turtle fucker vibes. Hey, cool. Uh, hey, piranhas, kill me. K kill me. Hello, there. hello, explorer. They won't. Yeah, they wouldn't kill me. Oh, goody, I'm back all the way over here. Good to have you in chat, explorer. We are just, uh, complaining. I love this game, but damn, is it not perfect. I love spending so long on a really hard puzzle or really hard platforming just for an egg. I don't even, I don't even know what egg I just got. What, what, uh, status screen. That was a Sergeant Bird egg I just got. What? Shouldn't I be getting the Sergeant Bird eggs in the Sergeant Bird game? I love this game as well. You forgot to buy... Or... Oh, right. Yeah, no, you just get them. Okay, so that has nothing to do... Did I? Did I? I, I thought I bought the... I thought I bought the head bash. Yeah, I have the head bash. You have one, one, Pokemon egg. <laughs> Sorry, blacked out, I guess. Yeah, okay. Alright, um... So the professor told me to find the co- or the, uh, the cloud domain, and I have gone pretty much everywhere except there. Let's go find- let's go find Cloud City. Son of a bitch. Dirty, rotten bastard. I've been playing stuff on my PS5. I- hmm. I keep- I keep thinking about getting my PS5 set up in my office here so I can stream from it, but, um... My internet's all- not all that great, so I probably would be able to stream at the highest fidelity. Wait, is that not Jess Harnell? Is that not? Oh, cool. I love that Spyro's a little brat. This guy, this is Turtle Fucker vibes. Water's not right. Get more water in the pool, dude. Can't swim in water that low. Get with the plan, dude. Spyro's always been an asshole. <laughs> oh, cool. I love when I just do arbitrary circles for no reason. Oh, cool. Circles. Yeah, I think the next big game that I'm probably going to play on my PS5... Uh, yeah, now that I have like some, some free time... I'm probably going to play God of War Ragnarok. It's just kind of been sitting on my shelf, but I've been so busy I haven't had a chance to, to play it.
Time to find Cloud City and stop the Galactic Empire. That's exactly what I'm thinking. Oh yeah, I don't have the water breath attack yet. Awesome. So wait, I can't do anything here. Wait, where the fuck am I supposed to go? Wait. I thought you just jump on the thing. Do you just jump on the thing? I thought this was a water breath attack. I thought this was a water breath. Oh, the okay, there are poles on it. There are poles on it. That's right. It's pull time, your favorite. Every everything in this game is my favorite thing in this game. <laughs> Am I missing anything hidden in this room? Oh well. If so, it's fine. Go talk to Otter Man. Water's not right. Get what? Water in the pool, dude. Can't swim in water that low. Get with the plan, dude. Light gem awaits. I'm currently playing Jurassic World Evolution 2 and trying to 100% Skywalker Saga on my PS5. I, I, the surfboard has his name on it. You do multiple wheelies. I I 100% in Skywalker Saga. I got the I got the platinum trophy in that. A, a lot of the games I play, I either already have the platinum trophy in, or um, are on the PlayStation 2 and don't have trophies. But I I'm I'm a big trophy hunter. I like uh, it does good things for my brain. Oh, and there's a blink thing around here. There's another blink mission. Me sitting here with only a switch, like, what's an achievement? <laughs> I mean, like, even in-game achievements, like, um, or just, like, in-game collectibles. Like, that's why, like, collectathons and, like, 3D platformers and stuff do such good things for my brain. Like, getting a gold bolt in Ratchet and Clank, that, that's, that does good things for my brain. Getting, getting a light gem in this game feels good. You want to see the first tie is really easy to 100 except for the fucking pictures gotta hate the invisible portraits really depends on the game for me if like the current game i'm playing or the game's franchise i will indeed get that platinum trophy tie two is a tie two is obnoxious oh goody so if i ever wanted to pick that back up wasn't the portraits tie two no there were invisible portraits in tie one Believe me, I've only completed Tai 1. I couldn't even be... I, I didn't make it very far in Tai 2. I remember really liking the final boss fight of Tai 1. Tai the Tasmanian Tiger 1. That had a really cool final boss fight. Like, an actual, like, boss. A boss that was more like a level that you could scale. That was cool. Picture frames. Yeah, I never had too much trouble... With that, I think, I don't know why. Yeah, that was sick. Yeah. I have no idea where I am anymore. I'm just getting shit.
Have you ever heard of Scalar? No. You'll know where you are eventually. We need tie 3 on PS4, PS5. Big agree. I would say, uh, I think, because I know Chrome Studio isn't around anymore, and, like, the, like, it, there's a fan, like, all of the remasters have been, like, fan-made. So I imagine tie 3 should be on the way. So cool, you'd have to emulate it. But please play it like this. If you like this and like beautiful worlds in a game that's fun to 100%, you really enjoy it. Uh, Scalar. Let me just write that down. I'll definitely take a look at it. I have um, I have a, a stack to get through, like uh, uh. Haven Call of the King, Scooby-Doo Unmasked, which I'm probably going to save until October for the, the spooky season. Um, I need to finish the Nightmare Before Christmas video game in October. There's also a TIE 4, but it's a 2D side-scroller. Nobody's heard for a reason. It's a Nightmare Before Christmas game? Yeah, it's called... Uh, there's a couple... There's one on the Game Boy that's a prequel to the movie, and there's one on, like, PlayStation 2, Xbox that is a sequel called Oogie's Revenge. It's not bad. It's by the same... It's by, um, Capcom, I think. So, it, it plays a lot like early, like, DMC. Yeah, and you can only play them in October. Absolutely! How dare you! We gotta get spooky! I really want to hear us tell modern consoles is so I can platinum it. Yeah. Like, I feel like a remastered version of, um, even just like Enter the Dragonfly and, uh, A Hero's Tale, like a collection of just those two game. A new... I feel like the, the Legend games would have to be like, obviously their own remastered trilogy, but I feel like by... Because Activision, with what they did with Crash, and just kind of, like, renouncing everything that came after Crash 3, I feel like there's diehard fans of every... Like, there's diehard fans of every Spyro game. Diehard fans of every Crash game. And I feel like by not acknowledging the later games, they're kind of doing a disservice to some, like, fraction, some some notable percentage of the fan base. Remake of the Enter the Dragonfly, that was the original scale of the game. Oh, please, like a director's cut that has, like, all of the cut levels, too. Upset about the lack of news for the T-Spyro 4. Spyro, Spyro's, like, this year is Spyro's 25th anniversary. If, it, if we don't get any information this year, I just don't think it's happening. Like, it's about time. Was there a Spyro 4? 25 years of Spyro, I'm so old. Yo. Uh. But yeah, they. So in some of the concept art for Crash 4, there's like. In like the city level, there's like a, a billboard that has Spyro and the number 4. Like it just says Spyro 4 on it. I'm not 30. I'm not 30 this year. You're 30 this year. Big oof. But you're also wrong. I am not 30 this year. It's okay. None of us are 30 this year. 30 is a magic... Like, 30 is an imaginary number. There's no such thing as 30. You just hit, uh... You hit 20, but there's now a star on your, uh, there's a now a star on your profile so that they know you're, this is like new game plus for 20s. Yeah, it's a, it, yeah, once you hit what would be 30, you you roll back to, yeah, new game plus. It's new game plus. I like that better. Alright, let's fucking bash whatever this is. no. Oh, I don't want to go to the sunken city. I want to go to the cloud city. 
Fuck. New game plus B start partially damaged. I love the big target painted on the stained glass. It's cool! But I don't want to do this just yet. I want to do the cloud. Okay, I guess that's in that direction, I guess. Hello again. Welcome back, Ray. Glad to have you back. We are still messing around. We're now in the coastal region. I think I need to go to the bit the stinky mole, but I'm not sure. Yeah, I think you're right. I will be very mad if Xbox exclusive of Xbox gets Activision. I mean, I'm pretty sure the merger is still being finalized, but they did state that, like, Acta Blizzard is going to be... Specifically, Activision Blizzard... Oh, it's, see, it's hard to say, because... Xbox has never been too concerned like they have their exclusives they have their fucking halos and forza and they have gears of war but they've never been too concerned about retaining exclusives like when game pass went to uh steam or when game pass went to pc and the master chief collection went to steam that was like really big but i think it's more so about getting residual money from anybody making the purchases like, they, they, they penned a thing with uh, Nintendo, basically saying that, like, it's a... I think it's, like, a 10-year contract to make sure Call of Duties end up on Switch, which is really weird. Remember the area, a bunch of tiny time platform things. You? Yeah. Have fun playing Modern Warfare 2 on your... on a 720 handheld Switch. We don't want... <laughs> we don't want them. I don't know. I think, uh, I think given how radical the, the gaming landscape has changed just in the last, like, three and three or four years with cock a duty you very mature. I think, uh, I think it's just too early to tell, um, like what's going to happen. Like, I, th I think it would be very strong if uh, Xbox actually kept, like, Fallout and Elder Scrolls as exclusives to their market. But I don't think they will because that would generate so much bad PR. It would be more lucrative for Activision and Blizzard to start generating new IPs for for Xbox and, and Microsoft than it would be to the, to now, like block off pre-existing IPs from console markets that have already had them in the past. I mean, I like I like the Switch just fine. I think I think Nintendo is really great about generating interesting um technology and kind of cuz like Nintendo has never been too concerned about being the top of like oh we have to have the best technology um they're just kind of like hey we're gonna stay in our own lane you know we're the 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 handheld console market that's cool we're gonna do that for a bit and they fucking dominated that market all of duty is so is bad also I'll enjoy not playing it Switch is so comfy, my hands are tiny, so the Joy-Cons are comfy as fuck for me. Fuck you, Otto. Neat. I don't know, I think every console kind of has their, their niche, their market, and I think the people developing for these consoles realize that.
not being stuck in controller position. It can lay in bed and have the switch propped up near my face. Super comfy. If the Steam Deck, if the Steam Deck had detachable controllers, I would have bought it, but it doesn't. I would. Why do I keep spinning? What is happening? Mmm. I got to figure out what's going on with this controller. Um, fuck. I don't know where the f fuck I'm going. Okay. I think the, I think the cloud, uh, cloud kingdom or whatever, the cloudy domain, I think it's over on the other side of the map. Wii U was a misunderstood console. Yeah, I just think it was poor marketing for the, the Wii U. Cause like going from the NES to the super NES, it, it, like it did look radically different, but I think like because the Wii and the Wii U central consoles look so similar at a glance. It looked like it could have been just an extra peripheral for the pre-existing Wii. It was... I just don't think it was marketed well. I think they should have come up with a different name for it. I, speci I specifically really do not want a Wii U because of the weird second screen thing. It's just the... It's the... <laughs> It's just a, uh, an... Oh my god. Okay, yeah. Please leave the screen. What is happening? I never know what's happening. So mad. That's right. The place they wanted me to go is fucking hidden. Oh yeah! I forgot about this. It's like a Nintendo DS thing. Except the DS was cool as hell and had some really cool games on it. The Wii U had Bayonetta 2, which is based as fuck. <laughs> I was trying to think of a, like a bad game for the Wii U and I could only think of Bayonetta 2, which is actually like, that game goes hard. Getting Bayonetta as a Nintendo exclusive was fucking wild. I'm really upset that we're losing it, like, Etrian Odyssey isn't going to be the same. I, I understand that. ADHD, you need to focus attention on one area. Yeah. Like, if it's, if it's like an action-oriented game where I need to pay attention to two screens, that can really, like, mess with me, like... That is, that sucks. But like, the Professor Layton games, or like, the later uh, uh, Ace Attorney games, easy. I can do that. That's fun. I love that. Oh, please. Oh, please. Also, the world ends with you, Neo, was done really, really well in the DS. I think it's Chaos was done so well and loved it. Like, I never got the f final remix on Switch because I was worried it would be late. But Neo was done actually well, but it didn't wow me as much as the first one. Understandable. I did not play the original The World Ends With You. I do have the, I do have the remake on uh, Switch. And I would say that um, it does not work as cool, awesome. The World Ends With You does not work as well um, on the, when it's docked, when the Switch is docked, that's definitely like a handheld Switch game, in my opinion. With a TV and a gamepad, I have a hard time looking between both, yeah. Although I remember one of the like big marketing sell one of the big marketing points of the Wii U was um if somebody wanted to use the TV, um, they could switch HDMIs. Like so long as the 
so long as the Wii U was kept on, you could continue playing it on the gamepad, or there was like a different way of playing it solely on the gamepad. I don't like how Nintendo still won't have achievements on their console and no DMing. You could always get the uh, there's an there's an app there's an online there's an app for Nintendo Switch, or it's a it's a phone app, but it's designed to be their version of like a live chat, for when you're playing Switch Online. It's integrated so poorly. There we go, and that was worth it. That was for a light gem. I don't like how Nintendo's oh no, DMing is because they're geared towards being family friendly and pedophiles exist. Big agree. There was a switch hack for custom profile pictures and people instantly used it to upload pornographic images because people are gross. Sorry, Automa. It's all good. I need to go through and because like that's a that's a fair point and not letting that message go through because of the word is, you know lame okay we finally made it to the cloud area this is where the cloud kingdom is or whatever let's fucking go to cloudy domain i don't even remember what the ability i get here is i don't know what the i don't know what the uh dragon elder is here the reason swap notes stopped existing on the ds is because people were using it to ask kids and or sin uh Oh, goody, I get the wing shield. That was my favorite part of Enter the Dragonfly. The thing that doesn't work. So Nintendo is very strict about letting people interact on the internet. Understandable. Because these gross assholes ruin it for everyone. I just remember people were really fucking dank on Splatoon. On a Splatoon 2, you could have like little notes above your character. I just remember people were really dank with that. It was really funny. This is probably nothing. This is probably a waste. Oh, it's a light gem. <laughs> that was not a waste. Fuck me, I suppose. Useless shield, yay. I am so excited for the useless fucking shield. Man, it's gonna be awesome. Music here is always such a bop. This whole game has a great soundtrack. Like, for real. What does this do? Exactly. Like, I love this level. I think the design is really cool. But I hate falling. <laughs> I remember as a kid thinking that, like, when I fall, why do I... <laughs> that shield will totally save us. Absolutely. I remember thinking as a kid, um... Oh, yeah, I can't do this yet because I don't have the fucking wing shield. There, I just went around. Um, I remember thinking as a kid, oh, goody, a flame egg. Perfect. Just what I wanted. I get to play as big nose. Um, until you get to the end and get a flying power up thing. I wasn't a fan of in the sky levels and spy games in general. New game plus big, big nose. At this point, yeah. Like how many... I have the most of the flame eggs. Am I really going to play through this game twice? Am I going to do a new game plus with the flame skin? No! <laughs> oh my god. What was I saying? Oh yeah, when I was a kid, I was like, when I fall, why do I die? 
The world is underneath me. I just came up from there. I should just land in the other... I should just land in the lower level. Why do I die? Oh. And nose, 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 nose. I'm not gonna lie, I have no fucking idea where I'm going either. I'm just kind of following this path. That's the plan, Explorer. We'll make it a... We'll make the new game plus as... New game plus plus as Ember. Wait, no! Girl Dragon is girl. God. Tell you what. I, I'll make a list. We need to make all of these cursed playthroughs, all of these cursed streams. We're gonna make them. We're gonna make them sub goals. I love that she shows up once, is horny, disappears forever. That's Ember. Same as Flame. Yeah, Flame. Flame is like, wow, Spyro, you're so cool. Anyway, I'm gonna die as soon as you leave this room. If they had given Flame time to, like, evolve as a character, I feel like they would have just become, uh, Tails. Like, from Sonic. I don't even... When you meet Flame, uh, so Flame is stuck in Nasty Nork's cave. Like, you when you get there, he does have character in Shadow Legacy. I don't remember Shadow Legacy. I remember I remember going I remember going to Treetops in Shadow Legacy and realizing that the Shadow Legacy version of Treetops is better than the original version of Treetops. Cool. Awesome. Um Shadow Legacy? Yeah, that was the DS Spyro game. And it was the last Spyro game in the official canon before they rebooted it for uh Legend of Spyro. Yeah, they, it was the last official, like, there's, there was lots of, like, Spyro spinoffs and stuff. Never even heard of it. I mean, to be fair, there wasn't a whole lot of marketing for it. It's an RPG. Yeah, it's an RPG, and it's also kind of like a best of of some Spyro levels. Like, a lot of the levels within that game are reused level names from prior games. Or I could just do that. I think... Alright, so I'm looking at the time, um, and I actually have some shit I have to do today. I think, uh, I think we're gonna meet the Elder and then call it there. So as soon as we get to the Elder. Okay, so that doesn't destroy that. Bust that up. Funny how we rebooted Spyro to a new universe and characters reboot back to the original canon. When are we going to talk about the real goaded canon? The Skylanders cartoon that was on Netflix. Oh, shit, he's right here. Okay. Titan. He was one of the peacekeepers. I hear you've been quite inquisitive about Red. Oh yeah, but everyone seems to be avoiding the issue. Can you tell me any more about him? About Jim? I don't know any Jim, but Red ended up being banished from the Order of Dragons for his terrible crimes. I've not seen him in years. He and I used to be friends until he turned evil. 
Then we drifted apart. You know how <laughs> he old in the sky. Do you know that you could deflect some projectiles with your wings by using them as a kind of shield? Fold your wings in front of you like this. Do you like origami? This will allow you to deflect blunt objects. Bear in mind, Spyro, sharp objects will still be able to penetrate your wings and harm you. Hello? This... Th this guy has... This guy's like... This guy's got dementia. Is he okay? Oh man, don't know about Dragon Elder Jim Titan. Oh man. Is he okay? Should we like send people regularly to check up on this guy? Oh man. Titan is not okay. Absolutely not. Alright, um. Oh look, an egg. Sure. We'll go get the fucking egg. All right. That's going to do it for me for today. Uh, if you're watching this on Twitch, hello. Thank you to everybody who stopped by and said hi. I always really appreciate it. I love hanging out with you guys. It's literally just, I'm going to play video games anyway. Might might as well just hang out with people. Uh, no, play this game forever. <laughs> he needs help. I will not play this game forever. I actually have things I need to do today. But, uh, I can see you later. If you're watching this on Twitch, hello, these VODs end up trimmed up over on my uh, YouTube channel. You can find that linked somewhere on the Twitch page, um, as well as my Twitter. That's where go live announcements are. I've also been using the community page on YouTube. If you're watching this on YouTube, hello, uh, these VODs originally aired on my Twitch channel. Um, I'm about to, I'm, there's the light at the end of the tunnel. I, I see time when I'm going to be able to get back to re regularly scheduled streaming. Drop me a follow on Twitch, follow me, you know, subscribe on YouTube, all that jazz, just so you know what goes up, when I go live, all that good stuff. Uh, you have things to do, like get the flame eggs. God damn it. <laughs> I will not get the flame eggs. If I, if I accidentally collect all of the flame eggs, fine. But I swear. Heading off, well, it was nice to meet you. Yeah! Uh, like I said, drop me a follow so you know when I go live again. Um, this is probably going to be a weekend game, if I'm being honest, like a Saturday or a Sunday. I don't know. Um, but with how my schedule is when I do stream regularly, it's usually like Wednesdays, Fridays, and either Saturday or Sunday. I think it just depends on my schedule and what's going on. Already did. Thank you so much, Hotch, and I super appreciate that. But, uh, yeah. That's, so, Twitch, YouTube, Twitter, that's all of the things. Um, thank you so much for watching. Be good, be kind, treat people the way that you want to be treated, and I'll catch you in the next one.